Hey y'all, this is Bridget with the Louisville Nature Center, and today I am checking out a pond near my house. I've been really curious about what kind of critters might live in this pond, so today we're going to do a little exploring, and I'll show you how you could do the same with a pond near you. Our supplies today are going to be a plastic colander so that we can scoop down into the water and see what kind of critters we can find, a bucket so that we can fill that up with pond water and watch some stuff swim around, and then we have a few small containers if we find a tiny critter and want to get a closer look at it. Okay, so I'm going to take this colander and I want to dip down into the detritus, all that monkey stuff, and pull it all out and let's see if anything comes up in the pond. It looks like a good habitat for some aquatic bugs and tadpoles. This, I want to say, is a mayfly larva and one day He's gonna become an adult and get some wings. I can more easily see he's got some little wispy tails. And if he's got three, that is gonna be a future mayfly. And he's a little bit further along. He's a bigger dude. We have a dragonfly nymph. This, this is awesome, you guys. You can see he's got teeny tiny little wings beginning to grow. So dragonflies lay their eggs in the water they hatch and they become these little dudes. He's gonna come out of the water and his big awesome wings are gonna come out. Now, dragonflies are predators. He has a mouth that actually detaches, like his jaw detaches from his face almost, and it becomes this little scooper. I think some of our snails have left little trails from where they were scooting around earlier. You may recognize this guy right here on the surface. That's called a water strider. They are very talented at skating on the top of the water. Well, we found all kinds of critters today in our pond. Um, you can do this at any pond or creek that you have access to. If you go to a creek, you might find crawfish. Different ponds might have even different species uh, than what we found here today. You may find some of these familiar friends again. As always, now that we are done investigating, we are going to gently let our friends back into their awesome habitat, their home, 